front porch, nice metal railings, vinyl siding. All right, here's the back of the uh, entrance. You walk into a dining room, got two columns, and then a um, wall with a large cased opening between the family room and the dining room, as well as a doorway. And this is what you see when you walk in the front door. Very open, very cottage-like. The doors have got arch molding on the top, on the insets of the door. Um, all of the windows are um, no mullions on the bottom window, and then you've got the cottage-style mullions on the top window. Nice big coat closet. Then you've got a second coat closet here, and then here's your family room. And this has got gas fireplace. It's got a ceiling fan. I'll get you the pricing and all the upgrades that are in here. It's got cable above the fireplace, and a lot of times if you want it, a builder or after construction, you can add cabinets and bookshelves on either side of the uh, fireplace. Breakfast nook here, um, very big, good size. You can put a good size table there. Um, kitchen has got a darker wood cabinet and uh, granite countertops, but you've got the microwave built in so you don't have to worry about losing space. Double bowl porcelain sink that's inset in the granite so it's easy to clean and then a nice large gooseneck um, faucet. And then you've got some spice racks or book racks on either side of the cabinets around the sink which is nice. And let's see, flat top um, opening for your refrigerator, nice big opening, it's got your water for your ice maker. And then around the corner you've got your half bath, nice size, and then a nice utility room on the first floor with a uh, shelf above, and then your hookups for washing. Here you've got your garage. It is insulated, I mean it is sheet rocked all the way throughout, and that's standard I believe. Does not have insulation underneath the sheetrock where it's not touching finished square footage. But it does have an automatic garage door opener, which is uh, a lot of times an option for other builders. You've got your, um, you have your shutoffs for your main water valve and your spigots right here in the garage so you don't have to crawl into the crawl space, which is nice. And there's your electric water heater. Don't pay too much attention to the backyard because this obviously would be a different lot if you built on it, but the deck is standard 12 by 14, which is probably a little bit bigger. I think my builders used to do 10 by 12 and 10 by 10, so that's a good size deck. Stairwell going up, it's got a nice turn to it. And then here is your hallway. You've got a little area with the window across and the chandelier. And then bedroom one, not a, it's kind of tough to take pictures of bedrooms, but here's a closet. It does have a ceiling light, which is nice. A lot of builders don't do that. And it's got cable in that bedroom. You've got another bedroom with ceiling light. This one does not appear to have cable. Hall bath. Very nice hall bath. Very nice. Long. Uh, double bowl vanity. Nice kitchen cab. I mean nice cabinets. And then a tub shower insert. So that's really nice being this uh, this wide and just to put it in perspective here's my feet and how much room is around me. So Good size. Sorry, you got a picture of me. Um, third bedroom, ceiling light, double closet. It also has a pull down attic. And then the owner suite. Oh, wow. Owner suite is very nice. You've got a ceiling fan with a light. And again, some of that's going to be extra depending on what the purchasers of this house added. But it looks like he's putting lights in every bedroom, so that's probably standard. Maybe the ceiling fan's an upgrade. Um, and then you've got a huge sitting room. So similar to that other floor plan, instead of having it as a closet, you've got it as a sitting room, which is an office. And that's very nice. And then here, you've got walk-in closet here with shelving along the top. And then a middle shelf. Second closet here. It is same thing, middle shelf, 
and then upper shelf all the way around. So I hope I'm not making you sick with my video. And then here is owner's bath. You've got a separate shower, separate tub, glass block, which is nice. That's in the light, but nobody sees you. Then you've got double vanity, nice big mirror, and your lavatory. So it's a nice house, very nice house with some nice upgrades.